Hey, anyone who might be watching, uh, I'm going to show you something in case you don't know it already, but I'm going to demonstrate it here for you to see. So you're going to some nice video, in this case this Dragon Link guy has this nice video. It's supposed to be HD footage, so I'm going to watch it a little bit. It looks all pretty. It's all nice, but then when you go to the big screen, it you're like, why the hell am I stuck in potato vision mode? And it really kind of sucks. So then you're like, okay, this is supposed to be HD. And my settings only give me 360 at the most. Like, what the hell is that crap? I mean, that's bullshit, right? Well, the thing is, is that it happens to be not this guy's fault. His video actually is HD, so it's perfectly fine as a video. But YouTube, in all their wisdom, uh, with HTML5, however they implemented it, it doesn't work on some computer setups or browsers. It just never goes past potato vision resolution. So, how do you get around that? And I have this little plug in here, and you switch back to Flash instead of using HTML5. And now it reloads and it says, oh, the HTML5 doesn't work, but when it comes on, guess what I get? I still see that option, but I get the HD back. So now I can watch the video in all this glorious uh, HD, nice, sharp, pretty resolution, and it looks good. So, yeah, if you're finding problems with uh, HD and you don't know why, it's because HTML5 implementation, it could be Firefox's fault too, but it's a combination of YouTube and viewing it with the Firefox. I know it's broken in a net case on my system, and this little YouTube video player, if I go to tools and add-ons, it will be... The YouTube Flash video player, it's just this one. There's more than one version of this, so... It's the one that looks like the little Flash logo, that's the one you want. Because the other ones, some of the other ones are scammy. This one, has, I haven't noticed anything bad so far, because I, I did take that caution. I've had other video downloaders and stuff that like to do spammy shit after a while. It's like they come in nice and they sneak stuff, but that one so far it seems okay. But the other thing you have to consider is Flash does have some holes in it. It always seems like it needs updates. So you got to decide, do you want like a more secure system or are you willing to take that risk? But the thing with this add-on is, is it lets you turn it on or off. And I guess it's particularly for YouTube, but you can decide whether or not you want to take that risk with Flash. But in this case, this YouTube is pretty safe. So I just switch it over to Flash and watch HD because to me that's more important than... Oh, HTML5, whatever that bullshit is. I mean, it's probably good on some systems, but if you can't watch your HD videos, that's the reason why the HTML5 implementation, in some certain corner cases, is definitely broken, because I've run into it. So I figured I'd just pass that along and go watch your videos in HD. So, yeah, because uh, <laughs> I know it was driving me nuts for a good while. I just figured I'd pass that along. All right, later.